Hey guys, Rodney here. This is uh, First Corinthians Report, uh, Section E. So, when we look at the three R's, which is the return, resurrection, and renewal of Christ, um, if we look at the return, you know, God sent Jesus to be born uh, Christmas. We go through his life, and he, he sets a tone, a foundation. He has... Um, followers and he's he's going to do all of these things and then you look at the resurrection and and I kind of do some research because I'm not uh I'm a I'm a, a beginning Christian uh so I'm not uh, I don't have a bunch of backstory but more or less I found Romans 8 through uh 18 through 24 for I consider that suffering of this present time are not worthy comparing with the glory that is to be revealed to us for the creation waits with eager longing for the revealing of the sons of God. For the creation was subject to futility, not willingly, but because of him who subjected it. In hope that the creation itself will be set free from its bondage to corruption and obtain the freedom of glory of the children of God. For we know that the whole creation has been groaning together in the pains of childbirth until now. And not only the creation, but we ourselves who have the first fruits of the Spirit grown inwardly as we wait eagerly for the adoption of sons, the redemption of our bodies. For his hope we were saved. Now hope that is seen is not hope for who hopes for what he sees. And so I, I feel like it, this passage, Romans eight eighteen through 24, is really speaking to the resurrection and how we are eagerly waiting um, for that. But, you know, with that resurrection, you know, to kind of point out that, you know, no one was expecting that. None of his followers were, um, no one was. And so when he beat death and he raised from the dead, it's one of those things that you, you know, no one was waiting for him outside of his tomb. They just didn't see it coming. So when he did that, it was like, we have to tell everyone, you know, it's, we are, um, we are saved by him because he beat death. And so that leads us to the renewal piece, which is, you know, we really are renewed in Jesus Christ because he did beat death and he um, died because of our sins. But more importantly, he um, renewed our, our, our spirits and, and, our, and, our, and, our, and who we are. And so I think with those return, resurrection, renewal, you know, that's kind of my brief synopsis of those three R's. Um, I think the key part of all of this is the resurrection because he did beat death. We are renewed um, in him through that. And so thanks for your time and have a good day.